Today we are going to speak about the Ethiopian students in Oranim. The heroic story about the exodus of the Ethiopian community and their terrible way to Israel is probably well known and well documented. Their absorption in Israel is far less known and perhaps no less hard than the travel from Ethiopia to Israel. We in Oranim decided two years ago to visit the Ethiopian communities in northern Israel. And what we have found there is not easy to describe in words. We found poor schools, sometimes poor teachers, a ghetto culture, but there was a ray of light, the young people, with a support that can be a leader. Yes, they can. We decided that the turning point with the Ethiopian community must start from schools and from those young Ethiopians who are able to lead education and leadership. Oranim started two years ago to collect from all over Israel those young Ethiopians who are able, who believe in themselves that they can lead their own communities. We now have about 40 of them. Next year we will have about 60 of them. Every year we choose 20 young Ethiopians who we believe can be a good educator and a leader in their own community. But this long process is costly. We have to overcome together with our students many obstacles to integrate those youth with our students, Israeli-born students, to make them acquainted with modern technologies, to close the gaps in basic education, in math, English, general knowledge, to make them acquaintance with the way that Western civilization are learning. For all these reasons, and in order to help this young Ethiopian student to bring light and better future to their own communities, we ask your partnership. We really need your support. Thank you so much. Samara, Samara, Samara.